Now, Amsterdam banned demonstrations for three days from Friday after overnight attacks on Israeli soccer supporters by what the mayor called anti-Semitic hit-and-run squads, and Israel said it would fly many fans home. Mayor Famke Halsema said Maccabi fans had been attacked, abused and pelted with fireworks around the city and that riot police intervened to protect them and escort them to hotels. Amsterdam banned demonstrations through the weekend and gave police emergency stop and search powers in response to unrest that exposed deep anger over the Gaza-Israel conflict. Israeli football fans were beaten and injured in violent clashes in Amsterdam overnight, which the Dutch government condemned Friday as anti-Semitic attacks on Israeli citizens. Dutch police said they had launched a major investigation into multiple violent incidents following the Europa League soccer game on Thursday night between Israel's Maccabi Tel Aviv and Dutch side Ajax. Amsterdam police on Friday said 10 people were taken in custody. Yesterday, there was an outburst of anti-Semitism such as we had hoped to see no more in Amsterdam. And I am furious and on behalf of the city council and on behalf of the Dreok, I express the strongest condemnation of the violence that has taken place among our Jewish Amsterdam residents. There is fear, dismay, anger, disbelief. Meanwhile, Israel has sent two commercial planes to the Netherlands to repatriate hundreds of Israeli football fans after overnight attacks in the streets of Amsterdam. Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's office said the order to send planes was taken, was given, in fact, after a very violent incident targeting Israeli citizens following the match between Maccabi and Ajax, Amsterdam. At least five people have been hospitalized. And European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen condemned the attacks on fans of Israeli football team. She posted on X saying, and I quote, outraged by last night's vile attacks targeting Israeli citizens in Amsterdam. I strongly condemn these unacceptable acts. Anti-Semitism has absolutely no place in Europe and we are determined to fight all forms of hatred. German Foreign Minister Annalena Baerbock also voiced her shock and disgust. She said, and I quote, the pictures from Amsterdam are terrible and deeply shameful for us in Europe. The outbreak of such violence against Jews crosses all borders. There's no justification for this. Jews must be safe in Europe. And the United Nations also reacted on the incident and said it was deeply troubled by the clashes in Amsterdam. We have seen uh, these very troubling reports. Nobody, nobody should be subjected to discrimination or violence on the basis of their national, religious, ethnic or other origin. We understand, as you point out, that authorities have launched an investigation into this incident.